is Deontay, D, D, J, and today we're going to be playing every single Road to WrestleMania in SmackDown vs. Raw 2011, the GOAT, in one video. And so when it comes to deciding which Road to WrestleMania I'm going to play first, I'm going to leave it up to Destiny, leave it up to the mystery wheel of fate. So let's go ahead and spin this bad boy. What is it going to be? It's going to be Rey Mysterio. Oh, no. <laughs> the way he falls over, he's like, Ugh. Go to your locker room, stop in and talk with your GM. Do whatever you want. Well, okay, uh, Vince says I can do whatever I want. So the first thing I want to do is call a media scrum, a WWE media scrum, and go off on all of my colleagues and get myself suspended. Can I do that? <gasps> Dante Inferno debut? This goes against everything I believe in. I don't want to put a flame out. I want the flames to rise. Okay, oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. W Riz, W Riz, Rey Mysterio. Did you say your name was? Ray, it's me, Evan, E.B., Evan Bourne. Yeah, sorry, buddy. It's it's not really ringing a bell uh, on account of my amnesia. What's up, JTG? We're bringing the hood to you. This looks kind of mad. Evan Bourne and Rey Mysterio are the most formidable tag team in WWE. <sighs> Yeah, yeah, I, I suppose so, dude. Uh, I, I'm gonna take some extra time to think about this and, and maybe look for literally anyone else. Nice. We'll beat him fast. Pause. Seeing stars, you're looking at Constellation. Uh-uh, he said it. He said the lie. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of one of those situations where I say, what have you done for me lately, Doctor? And I don't really think you've done anything for me lately, so I'm just gonna go ahead and walk away. Ray, listen. I'm worried about you. Well, why would you be worried about me? Is it the fact I was in a horrible car wreckage and then wrestled the same night? Is it because of my amnesia? Is it because of the way I treat Evan Bourne? Is it because I'm teaming up with Jack Swagger? Is it because I left that guy without getting a ladder underneath him? Is it because I'm teaming up with Jack Swagger and slowly becoming more evil by the week? Which one is it, John Morrison? Close your eyes and really think about what happened that day. Oh boy, here we go. It's time for a dream sequence. I wonder what I'm going to dream up today. I'm not your baby boy anymore. Whoa! Oh, God, Doc. I gotta tell you, that was the weirdest dream I've ever seen. Then we'll go hit the town with the Bellas. Just like old times. <laughs> the way he's trying to gaslight me. Yeah, ladies. This is a good time. Don't ruin it by copying an attitude. <laughs> oh, God. You can't say that anymore, Ray, I don't think. I bet you forgot about the time I made John Cena tap out at the Royal Rumble. <laughs> Oh my god, the gaslighting is out of control! And you're gone. Later, bitch. And last but not least, goodbye, Finley. I say, later, bitch. Draw Rumble winner 2010. If I didn't know better, I think you were out to get me. Um, I've pretty much been saying that the whole time, Evan. I don't know if you've been keeping up. My relationship with Scott Colton ended long before I paid all of his bills. What? What? What the hell is he talking about? Who the hell is Scott Colton? Hey, I don't know if I'm the only wrestling fan who thinks this, but does anyone else get extreme anxiety when anyone is in an electric chair position nowadays? What the hell is Evan Bourne's problem? Like, Jack Swagger has been nothing but nice to us. And this guy just can't accept that I have another friend, okay? He can't accept that I've moved on from him. This is how exes are. Oh, wow. That was actually quite a nice spear, I'm not gonna lie. You can't talk to the two of us like that. Right, Ray? Edge. It doesn't matter what you- Let's teach this fool a lesson. Yeah! Let's teach this guy a lesson! He's cruising for a bruising! Yeah, cause f you, Edge. You'll never get in the way of me and Jack's love. I know you want as much love as he gives me, but he can't give it to you. Go find another loser, like Evan Bourne. Oh, it would appear that Jack Swagger is taking out the trash. <laughs> I won't let you talk bad about me and my Boyfriend, best friend. Uh, yeah, yeah, best friend. That's that's what I also said. Let, let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the hell was that? I don't even know if that was an actual license move, but nevertheless, we're pulling it down. No, no, no. Warm up, warm up, warm up, warm up, warm up. Oh my god. Jack Swagger went flying to the outside of the ring. Oh yeah. This is how it goes down. This is the big reveal. Yeah. He crashes. First of all, how is he driving like this in the backstage area? How does this happen? You know what, even though I clearly saw this damning evidence against Jack Swagger, I kind of feel like I still want to be friends with I him. I feel like maybe he's a little misunderstood. I mean, he didn't mean to crash the car, probably. Take the contract. You deserve it. Our friendship means way more to me than that. See, look at this. Oh, he's a good guy. He wants to be friends. He's giving me the contract. Mr. Swagger, I cannot possibly stay mad at you, you lovable son of a bitch. Let's go. Oh, look at that. We 
we hit him with the high low. Yeah, I will shake the hand of that man. I'll ride into battle for Jack Swagger. You damn right. He will be the greatest team known to man or beast. Oh, I know what you're talking about, Mr. Jack Swagger. You ain't talking about a tag team in the ring. You talking about tag team in the Bella Twins. Oh, speaking of people I'd love to tag team, hello Mickey James and Beth Phoenix. I proved once again why I am the most dominant diva in WWE. I mean, sh would you like to, uh, dominate me? Well, there it is. I, uh, punked the hell out of CM Punk at Elimination Chamber and now I'm world champion. Let's go. I'm on top of the world right now. And to celebrate, my friend, I got you a little something. It's in your locker. Go have a look. Wait, no, hang on a second. Is this the attire? Is this what I wanted the whole time? Is this the evil Rey Mysterio attire? Oh my god. <gasps> yeah! Thanks, Jack. You're a nice guy. Yeah, don't tell anybody or I'll crack your jaw. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's... That's concerning. Listen, I'm not saying I turned heel on Evan Bourne just for the attire, but this attire is exactly why I turned heel on Evan Bourne. Hey man, get the hell off your phone. How about you interact with the real world for you once? You goddamn kids always on your phone. What are you doing, scrolling Twitter right now, huh? Have you seen the bowling pin memes? Because I have and I hated Look it. Look at him, he's obsessed. Straight back to the phone. God damn it, Edge, get off the- Oh my god. You know what, I'm just gonna run away from the scene. I pushed that man into an entire other dimension. We don't need to talk about if it. If you see Edge in the next episode of the Micro Multiverse, that's exactly how we got that okay that's canon i see what you did and so did everyone else but if you're happy the way you are oh he's really happy yeah jack swagger is keeping me very happy and satisfied okay i don't need you evan born leave me alone <laughs> look at this man's evil scowl oh man honestly this love story is just getting a little too much for me i think we need to take out evan born i can't stop this well, i can't wait to see who uh evan born didn't get as a partner because he has no friends what? Wait, 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 what? Oh my god, <laughs> that legitimately caught me off guard. You know what, Evan Bond? Rare, extremely rare Evan Bond W. Sweet home Alabama. Um, <laughs> out of context WWE games, you want this clip? He may try to weasel out of here with his United States Championship. I'll set him up, distract the ref, and you smack him one. Okay, I'll smack him too. Fine. It's like I'm babysitting the world's biggest <laughs> Here we go. Oh, yeah. Bouncing off his skull. Oh, my God. Would you look at this? This man is executing some W Riz on one of the Bella Twins right now. Let's go and eavesdrop. Let's see what's going on. You see this title, Nikki? It means I'm champion of the whole United States. That is how that works. See? All 50 states, baby. Even Guam. <laughs> Even Guam. <laughs> This guy, how can you not love this guy? Now it's time to execute some loose game on uh, Nikki or Brie or whichever one that is. Go find someone who cares. Okay, okay, okay. She, that, that's, that's, uh, she's flirting with me. Um, yep, she's, she's playing hard to get. Oh God, I don't like how this is being set up. I feel like I'm about to get jumped by everyone. Oh God, I need to run away. I, I just got to live in denial. Oh brother. Uh, Matt Hardy, Shahad, JTG. I don't suppose you guys are here for a good reason, right? I'm really sorry, amigo. I... I had... Oh, It was a nasty sight. <laughs> yeah, listen, Evan, I got other road to WrestleManias to attend to. I'm afraid I'm just gonna have to job you on the grand stage. I'm the one you owe everything to. I, I've been saying that the whole time. You know what, Jack? I've decided I'm gonna do the job for you, brother. Go ahead and put me down. I'm putting the controller down. I'm not even touching the controller right now. Yeah, hit me with that gut wrench power bomb, Jack, this is what you deserve. I'm gonna make this alternate ending my own. There we go. Nah, do it. Ref, count it. I don't care. I'm putting him over. I'm putting him over. Brilliant. Well done, Jack. Da -da, check what's- What? Breaks my heart. 6-1. I didn't want to have to do this. I didn't want to have to do this. Okay, here we go. Oh. I'm sorry. I love you. <laughs> now let's go ahead and find out what the next road to WrestleMania is going to be that we play here today. It's versus Undertaker. Uh-oh. I'll beat anyone you put in front of me. Oh my god, that sounds exactly like the guy that voices Dante Inferno. That's perfect. Chris Jericho? What brings you to Raw? <laughs> this is just not a Dante Inferno voice. I'm excited about starting the Raw portion of this tournament to decide who will take on The Undertaker at WrestleMania. You'll be thrown into the fire early. I mean, that's perfect. You can throw me into the fire right now. I'm Dante Inferno. I was built for the f flame, Stephanie. I wouldn't get anywhere near Undertaker. I mean, 
Didn't he encase Paul Bear in cement? Yeah, he did, but honestly, I could encase you in my cement. Ugh, ugh, that's disgusting. Hang on a second, Randy. Oh my god, the flame dagger straight through the soul of Randy Orton. And now, oh, oh, oh wait a second, the Inferno Overdrive SVR 2011 edition. Only one person can break the streak, Michael. You're assuming a lot. What if nobody can do it? Did you hear what they just said? Ooh, that didn't age well. I'm awesome, and that streak will never be broken. Ooh, yeah, who's gonna tell him? <gasps> it's my best friend! Wait, what? <laughs> what? What was that? No, 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 Jack, 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 please, 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 no! Ah, you know what, Chris? You've caught me on a day where, coincidentally enough, I'm feeling like a bit of an evil bastard. So, uh, yes, let's work together. And if I see you need a hand? You'll see me out there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, Big Show. I was wondering if you could give me some advice on anal beads. Let me tell you right now, from experience, the reward is not worth the cost. Oh, uh, uh okay. Th thank you so much. Hey, Mickey, you're so fine. You're so fine. You blow my mind. Hey, Mickey, time to spit some W Riz once again. I don't understand why you're trying to fight Undertaker at WrestleMania. Do you have some sort of death wish? Yeah, I guess he could say that, Mickey. I've got a bit of a death wish. I wish you'd crush me to death with them thighs. <laughs> he hit with a code breaker right in front of the referee. We don't give a sh- <laughs> And then he runs away. Oh my god. It's adorable. The way he was just like, uh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna leave now. And he taps out to the walls of Jericho. Job well done. I mean, I'm just saying, man, live a little. Get noticed. I mean, maybe ask Maurice for a Cleveland steamer once in a while. You make me sick. Okay, you know what? I don't think I can spit some W Riz on this Bella Twin Piola because she seems to be trying to, uh, electrocute me like Emperor Palpatine. <laughs> Oh, 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 it's the Undertaker! Oh. You know what? I'm just gonna pretend the Undertaker isn't here. I'm just gonna, you know, uh, ignorance is bliss. I'm confused. There wasn't a clear winner to this match. Oh, really, Michael? Nice. Nice point out. Okay, uh, I might be going insane here, but did anyone else see that? Oh, hey, Mark. I was wondering, uh, just a quick question. What should the next Deontay DDJ GM mode be? Make an impact. Uh, uh, impact. Uh, okay, if you say so. You are one. <laughs> It's the American roller coaster. Uh, I don't really like his face. When I win this ladder match, I go on to WrestleMania, where I will make history. Yeah, talk your sh Dante. Talk your. F oh, hey, Big Show. So, uh, since the last time we spoke, have you uh, given any more thought to the anal beads thing? I'm feeling particularly nasty tonight. Oh, well, that's perfect then. Well, anyway, I got the briefcase. Jericho just died. Well, you know, in this road to WrestleMania, Stephanie, I already made your husband my. I guess you're next. What? Oh, wait, wait, wait a second now. Uh, hello? Oh, hey, Big Show. Real quick before I uh, go home, Stephanie sent me home, but uh, how were those anal beats on the way out? I barely broke a sweat. Just you watch. Preferably from a distance. Uh, you know what, Big Show? Uh, I'm okay. I don't really want to watch uh, tonight. Maybe next week, though. The show's not over. Someone may want to tell him that. <laughs> the, co the commentators are just like, where the hell's he going? Well, what's going on? Oh, God, I remember this so well. Oh, God, this is making me a bit dizzy. Look, it's the druid right there. Wait a second. This druid is standing on the diva's side, which means... Is it time to spit some W Riz on a druid? Okay. Hey, druid, so uh, I was just wondering, uh, would you like to see what's under my hood? He look like he's 100%. Something strange about him over the last few weeks. So, miss, I hate to hark on an old issue, but have you given any thought to the Cleveland steam? You need help. To beat the Undertaker, you'll have to get inside the Undertaker. I'll have to do what? In your locker room, now. Uh, okay. <laughs> you have to find the urn. Use it to contain lost souls. Yeah, well, you need to find some big, big fella. Don't you have a match? Didn't you hear? It's WWE 2K23, Stephanie. They're adding microtransactions to everything. They what? Oh, no, I... And by the way, would you take a look at this trophy cabinet right here for a second? There's a GM award, a GM award, another GM award. My God, if I didn't know any better, I'd think this was Deontay DDJ's trophy cabinet. <laughs> Ah, there we go. We just collected a platinum trophy from the PlayStation Network. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell did I walk into here? <laughs> to take a quote from every 80s sitcom ever, that just happened. <laughs> I love how the Big Show's really trying his hardest to flirt with Eve Torres and I'm collecting a soul. What in the Dave Meltzer is this? I'm not there tonight, and won't be for a while. 
In my place, Ra is getting a guest general manager. Well, I wanted to keep it a surprise, but ladies and gentlemen, I am playing the SmackDown vs. Raw 2011. Deontay DDJ is the guest GM in this Road to WrestleMania edition. Another opponent from Undertaker's past will challenge you tonight. Oh my god, wait a second. Am I going to have to face hip surgery? You lost your mind, dude. <laughs> yeah, probably. Listen, fat man. I love this. <laughs> oh my god, my guy sounds exactly like Stewie Griffin. And you can all go. Yeah! Oh, come on, man. What the hell? Did they not teach you in Wrestling Academy? If someone goes to hit you, you've got to sell it. Sell it. At WrestleMania, I will take your soul. Fat little pup have tried to put me through hell. Okay, Dante, maybe relax a little bit on the fat shaming. I know it's 2011 and everything, but that could still come back to haunt you. It's still pretty recent. The Undertaker. Because at WrestleMania, your streak will <laughs> I was betrayed and buried under a ton of semen by my Undertaker. You were buried under the Undertaker's semen? What did this guy just say to me? I guess now that your job is done, so is your usefulness. And now we're just gonna beat this poor fat man lifeless. If I didn't know any better, I'd think Dante Inferno was behind that whole Dear Fat People video from a few years ago. <laughs> oh my god, why would you do that to me, Undertaker? I was kind of on your side there. This guy is annoying. I understand why you buried him under your semen or whatever it was you did. Please, no! Oh, and okay, there goes Paul Bearer. You know what? We've got one brother that's getting cancelled for all kinds of awful tweets, and the other brother is just, just taking out fat people. Wow, what a family, huh? This is huge. It's WrestleMania. And you are going to take on The Undertaker. That's awesome. <laughs> oh my god, this guy is awesome. I love you, Rob Van Dam. And here we go. I was saving whipping this one out for WrestleMania Undertaker. Clothesline from Dante's Inferno to The Undertaker. Wrap it up, referee. The streak is over. You and your streak will rest in <laughs> oh no, what is going on right now? This is one of the most ridiculous- Imagine if this is how it actually happened in real life. This is how the streak ended. Oh no. There has ever shown anyone as much respect as he did right there. I don't know about that one, Michael. I, I just don't know about that one. Have we seen an era come to an end, Michael? No, don't worry, King. He'll be back uh, next year and the year after that and the year after that. Wait a minute, what the hell was the referee doing in the background right there? Well, nevertheless, anyway, kill switch and gauge. Oh, my king, my king. I'll give you the thrashing you so desperately deserve. Wait, pause? Oh, would you look at who is over there? It's Bella 1 and Bella 2. Time to execute some W Riz and a new road to WrestleMania. I'm thinking Ed. No fair, I was gonna say Ed. Ladies, ladies, you can both make me... Christian, I hope my ECW champion is doing well. Look at that already. She's sending me voice notes. Hello, Christian. I hope you're doing well. W Riz, it's what it is. <laughs> Thanks for taking care of those guys. If you need anything, just call. Okay, okay. So basically, when we're risking up the ECW baddies, you're gonna be on my side. Okay, I got I'm it. I'm a little bit dazed and confused right now. There's nothing on the minimap telling me where to go. Did I complete the game? Is this it? I'm so sorry. Please take the rest of the night off. Oh, you know what, Tiffany? I can wrestle a match now. I've saw my inspiration and idol, Cody Rhodes, live in person. I don't need a night off. Oh, <laughs> what a guest. You've been traded, player. Now, after the Royal Rumble, you're Pete's, and I will be watching you perform on my show. <laughs> Christian's face said it all. Later, Irish bitch. Later, gold standard bitch. <laughs> ECW is no SmackDown, and you're no Dolph Ziggler. Oh my god, are we really starting a feud with Dolph Ziggler? William Regal, congratulations on that Mickey Mouse championship that is going to die in a month anyway when the entire show gets cancelled. Ha <laughs> ha. I want to thank ECW's general manager. She literally stabbed us in the back. I do not like Tiffany. Screw Tiffany. She'll be out of a job in a month. Former ECW champion, future SmackDown superstar, Christian. Boo, you suck. You're not even the best blonde on the brand. Eliminating 10 other superstars. 
but then you face Triple H. <laughs> Again, another predicting the future moment. CM Punk was on a wave of momentum, and then he met Triple H. What does that sound familiar from? Uh, hey, JTG loved your match with Bojack in the future DPW. You want to be- And get lost. Uh, okay. Oh, well, would you look at who it is? This isn't 1999. I'm my own man now. The man. Yeah, maybe for a few more years, bud, but when Becky Balboa arrives, you're finished. Is that Kane texting? Oh my god, this man is fighting for his life over there. He might have just had some Taco Bell. Kane just destroyed me tonight. Oh my god, I, I I literally just wanted to see if you were okay. I don't care about what you and Kane do in your spare time. I like how we went from, I don't really want to team up with you, Christian, to I'm bringing the entire gimmick back and I'm humping the ring map. See that weirdo staring at us through the TV? What this really reminds me of right here, it's like Shad is Duke Dennis and then uh, JTG is Kai Sana. Uh, Edge, real quick, what are your opinions on Deontay DDJ being the greatest general manager of all time? Often imitated, never duplicated. Yeah, that's kind of what I'd say too. Oh my god, that was a rough bump right there that Jericho took. Oh my god, we're about to crisp and I mean, we're about to slam this man. Oh, oh god. Oh, Dante Inferno. Oh my god, how poetic is this? William Regal's the final one at the top of the ladder. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness. Kill Swain from the top of the ladder. Oh my god, Spear. Spear from the top of the ladder. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. You've gotta be kidding me. I spent like an hour playing the match just so William Regal could sneak up behind and win the... Just use the money in the bank app on your phone and we'll work it out. <laughs> I forgot how in this game, it's a money in the bank app on your phone. That's incredible. <laughs> Look at this as well. It's like going on a dating app. Uh, I think I want to date Edge. Uh, I don't know. I just like his hair. But just because I've kind of been evil this whole time in this Road to WrestleMania video, I was going to pick Edge anyway and just stab him in the back. So I also don't really think this is my Christian because my Christian be being an evil bastard that I am, I would have cashed this in on Edge after a match, not before a match. My world heavy championship make no mistake it's still mine <laughs> okay buddy we'll see about that mister i'll tell you one thing i'm not about to let edge fuck me over like edge fucked over my oh this this is awkward i'm disappointed in how you played edge like you don't remember when you said oh i'm gonna fuck leader and then edge was like well then i am too i stole that from twitter i'm so sorry at superstars next thursday in fact you know what now that i'm realizing it, it's actually kind of brilliant that they're challenging me on superstars because that's next thursday and wrestlemania is this sunday and this is only a road to wrestlemania so <laughs> it doesn't even matter oh my god what the hell edge what the hell did I do to you to deserve this, huh? Kelly Kelly, more like Kelly Kelly's nuts in your mouth. <laughs> uh. On edge, climb up the ladder, edge, climb- No, no, that's not how this was supposed to- Oh my god! Which way is this gonna go? Which way is this gonna- Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! No, it didn't even work! What the hell was that? I thought we did it. You know what? I don't care. The game gave me an achievement for it. I'll take oh it. Oh my goodness me. I'm such a spot <laughs> headbutt from the top of the ladder. Come on, Edge. Climb the ladder. You know what I'm gonna... No, I lost my finish at the last minute. No. There's always a plan B, Edge. Oh my god, he went straight past the ladder. Okay. I got a second, Edge. Please, climb faster. You're not gonna get to do the spot in time. Edge. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness me. Here we go. Here we go. Kill switch through the table! And here we go, Christian. Oh my god! This is the greatest game of all time. Oh, that was great. That that has made me feel like a kid again. That was a fantastic road to WrestleMania. I loved every set. Oh, oh. oh he's he's just putting a seat down. Brother, there's like five more matches on this card. Will you hurry up? I wonder if that player dork thought you were gonna hit. Uh, no, I, I I didn't think that. Me when Gigi Dolan posts a new Instagram picture. I'm I think Orton is hoping they'll finish each other off. <laughs> what was that, Jerry? This guy's been saying some awfully sus things today. Because MVP looks good even when he loses. Oh, that's the last thing you want, buddy. You remember the whole Dolph Ziggler thing? If you look good losing, you'll lose your entire career. Don't you don't want to look good losing, man? Oh, <laughs> look who it is. It's my favorite, Cody, and and Ted. <laughs> sorry, sorry, MVP. I'm just such a big fan of Cody Rhodes. I see a lot in the kid. Okay. Well you better come with more than that next time, pal. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a great road to WrestleMania. You're a big boy. What do you uh, want me to- I, I don't like the way she said big boy right there. I, I, something about that made me uncomfortable. Hello? Yes, 
I understand. Guess who's going to jail tonight? After you calm down, madman. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll give you that, Ted. That was kind of funny. As for you, Cody, don't you worry. As soon as you get that neck tattoo, you will unlock all your true potential. Oh, no. Not these guys. In one of those SVR 2010 Road to WrestleManias, these two were like bodyguards, and they came into Vince's office, and they beat the hell out of you, I think, if I remember correctly. Ah, oh, no. How do you answer step? No, I don't want to vacate the arena calmly. F*** you. <laughs> oh my god, I just set this man on fire by throwing him into a TV and he ran instantly right back at me like a Russian bulldozer. This man's insane. You came between Maurice and me last week. You interfered with destiny. Who am I to interfere with true love? She's a looker, don't get me wrong. But does she really understand the Celtic warrior? You may be right, Cena. I'll let you go. <laughs> oh, man, that was great. That was W interaction right there. The other thing is, I never got in the way of you. I don't even remember what you're talking about. Uh, just go away. Oh. Okay. Little bit racist. Hey, Mickey, you're so fine. You're so fine. Mwah. Yes, John. I screwed you. What are you going to do about it? Oh, don't say that, Randy. I love when you talk dirty. After all I've done, you have no... <laughs> There's a hit or a button. Well, you know I've got to be a bad f*** this guy. Oh. Stone Cold Steve Austin and stop in a mud hole through the spirit of John Cena. Oh. Take him away. Take him to jail. Yes, jail. I'm sure Randy's worried, too. But in his new position, he probably feels pretty secure. You're telling me that Randy Orton is trying new positions without me? John Jan, I will send you a postcard from Hollywood. <laughs> I love Santino, man. What a go. Somehow, he got Stephanie to step down as GM, and now Orton himself is claiming the job. Not if I have anything to say about it. There's only one general manager in this town, and it's me. Hey, Jailbird. Out on bail so soon? Hey, Jailbird. My God, I ship Orton and Cena so hard. I'll give you your match for tonight. Wow, let me guess. It's going to be Vladimir Kozlov and Ezekiel Jackson, right? Vladimir Kozlov and Ezekiel Jackson. Ah, okay. You know what? To be fair, I know he's supposed to be a in this road to WrestleMania, but kicking off your age of GM Orton with an elimination style tables match is a pretty great way to do it. Because a girl I'm not even dating has a stalker who thinks I'm her ex-boyfriend. <laughs> what? You know, Evan Bourne has had so many shit things happen to him throughout this video that I'm almost starting to feel bad. Almost. Oh, I might be too far away. I'm too far away, aren't I? I'm too- Wait, 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 wait. Oh, man. I ain't worried about him. I've beaten him more times than I can count. <laughs> you know what? I'm not going to lie. I kind of enjoy the chaos He here. literally just manipulated the footage and pitted us against each other. Oh, God. You know what? I respect it. GM to GM, I respect it. I didn't think that video looked legit. You're still okay in my book, Cena. Ah, <laughs> yeah. So what are you saying? I'm okay in your book? Do you want to maybe uh, book a dinner together? All right. You're right. On the road to WrestleMania, it's every uh, man from... Uh, 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 he said it! He said it! Road to WrestleMania! He said the thing! <laughs> I forgot about that animation in this game. No, this is truly insane when you really think about it because we were best friends at this week's Raw. And then Orton showed a little video clip and now we're gonna beat the hell out of each other. Yeah, here we go. Uh, attitude adjustment. Maybe on that chair if I can turn him around. I turned him the wrong way. Okay. That's my bad, y'all. That's my bad. Oh, oh good God. Oh. <laughs> Will Raw's general manager leave St. Louis with the WWE Championship? Oh my god, that's a fantastic idea. When I bring back the Raw GM mode, I'm going to put myself in the matches and then book myself to win. I will say, though, I am really going to miss playing this game now that I've completely played all the Road to WrestleManias in one video. If you guys do want to see me play more uh, like SmackDown vs. Raw games and stuff and like going back to these Road to WrestleManias all in one video or even just one Road to WrestleMania or a video, let me know. Because I am so down to just play these until uh, WWE 2K. 23 comes out. Your match was so great that I'm going to let you two do it again. See, this is exactly why I am the greatest general manager of all time. I would never book a rematch straight after the pay-per-view. Randy, you suck. I need someone big enough. Tough enough. <laughs> what is this conversation? Man, the asylum, he should be locked in. Oh, that's a Dean Ambrose reference, guys. That's a Dean Ambrose reference. <laughs> Absolutely headshot. There's was no need for that. You just had to hit him with the chair. You didn't have to make him crisp. The psychopath, John. <laughs> yeah, I like this gimmick, Randy. Your, your booking is actually good. I take back what I said. This is amazing. I'm enjoying it. You want a title shot at WrestleMania? You'll have to do it for the World Heavyweight Championship. Oh, I mean, that's not too bad. Isn't Evan Bourne or Rey Mysterio the world champion in this? Like, 
Well, that's pretty easy, to be honest. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> how could you hate him? Honestly, how could you hate him? Oh, here we go. He's going to give the don't try this at home speech. Everybody get the popcorn. Bryce, we pay to compete and entertain the greatest bands in the world. I've had surgery five times in my left knee. But all these people treat me like I'm dangerous. Like I'm out of control. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on anymore. I'm just making my own jokes. This promo is awful. Move on. I think most of the problems stem from the fact that while I was getting waylaid by Big Show, you were spitting wad girls in the audience. <laughs> oh, I don't like where this conversation's going and it's ruining my image of Triple H. I, I, I think I should just leave. Honestly, I don't know what the hell's going on on Raw right now. There's just a bunch of bullshit going on. And quite frankly, nothing may ever make this better. Oh my God. The boyhood dream has come true. <laughs> If it wasn't for these age of old Yo, that sh had me tripping. Wait, wait, no, no, no way. This is this is one of the most poetic endings to WrestleMania I've ever seen in my life. This is one of the most poetic WrestleMania endings. I tap out Randy on as Cody Rhodes takes out MVP with a crossroads. Oh, this is the greatest game ever. <laughs> the achievement unlocked. Randy's fired. Yeah. Here I thought you weren't qualified to be Raw's GM. Oh, but I know someone that is. Keep from getting too damaged. Win with your finisher, and it might raise your stocks. <laughs> that was such an unnatural way to say all of that. I'll see you at Superstars on Thursday. Oh, not Superstars. Like this good-for-nothing monobrow joke. <laughs> I don't know if I can get behind Chris if he's going to go after Santino. I like Santino. And you, Michael Cole. Well, now, wait a minute. Michael Cole slander in 2011? I'm on board. Hey, I'm no WWE superstar. I'm a broadcaster. And less than a year after this game released, he would be at WrestleMania in a match against Jerry the King Lola. The United States Championship is not my style, Stephanie. But if you're not interested, I guess I'll just have to make it non-title instead. You know what? I'm not going to lie. As foolish as that may seem that Chris Jericho would just cost himself a chance at the United States Championship, I kind of get it. It's like 2010 right now. No one cares about that title. Just for that? I'm going to take my time and really punish you before I pin you. Then what else are you going to do? What did you say? What? I, I didn't say anything. Well, 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 after tonight, you won't be saying anything either. I'm going to shut your mouth. Okay. <laughs> what a weird interaction. Eve Torres was genuinely doing nothing. And Beth Phoenix was like, oh, yeah, huh? I'll beat the f out of you. I'll f you up. Is this a good time to mention that I really enjoy the Jarrah Show theme song? Well, break the walls down. It's the big show. Oh my god, that song was a banger. Uh, guys, I'm not really sure if I want to interrupt the big show right now. He appears to be meditating. I'm coming after the WWE champion. It doesn't matter who it is. It could be Triple H. It could be you. <laughs> you see his face? I'll take your place in the WWE Championship match at the Royal Rumble. Uh -huh. You're lucky to have a friend like me. <laughs> and that's... <laughs> and they put the little Raw logo. What was that? The main event segment? Oh, God. I love this WWE stuff. In the words of Vladimir Kozlov, I love Double Double E. <laughs> uh, anything else, Vladimir? I love Double Double E. Chris, I'm going to need to see you in my office immediately. Oh, come on. Are you telling me my actions had consequences? The hell, this is the backstage area for the Royal Rumble pay-per-view? Is anyone competing in the Royal Rumble? Uh, <laughs> we've got Rey Mysterio running around. Did I miss a memo? Maybe I'll do you a favor and trade numbers with you. You know, use some time to put on a show. <laughs> yeah, let's go, Yoshi. You tell yes. him. Thanks for coming so quickly. That's what she said. It's your fault Big Show was hurt in the first place, Chris. Do you think I'm an idiot? Well, I'd rather not say. <laughs> it's now no disqualification. And if you lose, you're fired. No, no. Stephanie, please don't fire me. There's not even an alternative yet for me to go to. What do you want me to go? To Orlando? To Impact? To TNA? I won't do it. I have lost my mojo. No. No, no, don't say it, Santino, don't say it. If you have the guts to show up at Superstars after seeing my opponent tonight, then you're on. No! Oh, oh I hate Superstars. Anytime anyone in this road to WrestleMania says, I'll see you Thursday for Superstars, I want to die. Listen, okay, I love this game. Until the end of my days, from the bottom of my heart, it's the greatest ever to do it. But if you think I like playing Superstars matches in this road to WrestleMania, you'd be wrong. You know, realistically, if Stephanie was actually a good general manager, she'd be pretty impressed that Chris Jericho beat up the big show. Like, I know I would. This is only our first match, Michael. 
We're in for a wild night. Yeah, I don't know about that one, Jerry. I, I was backstage earlier and I saw no one for this Royal Rumble. You guys are screwed. <gasps> it's my best friend again. Chris. Have you seen Hornswoggle around? Don't tell him I'm looking for him. <laughs> okay. So, uh, apparently Jack Swagger is in a feud or a storyline with Hornswoggle. Look at this. Even when it's not his road to WrestleMania, he steals the entire show. Quite frankly, I want to switch to him. I can I do the whole GTA 5 switching character thing where I play as Jack Swagger now? Aha! There he is, the little green fecker. Get lost. I'll give you an autograph later. Um... Chris, I, I don't think that's a fan. It's about my vengeance. Oh, that's why they called the pay-per-view vengeance. I get it now. Well, well, it appears we have two more victims of eating Taco Bell. We are all winners, except the people who are not us. Who are losers. Move over, civil rights activists Cody Rhodes, Martin Luther King, and Malcolm X. We got a new inspirational force in town. His name is Santino Morella. Well, anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and sneak over here and uh, steal the WWE Championship. Oh, you see that juke? Rey Mysterio, you're a bum. No, why did he drop it? Why did you drop the title? What do you think you're doing, Jericho? I'm, I'm just cosplaying as Triple. Oh, God. Oh, no. Out of context, this move seems kind of crazy. The juke, the security guard. Oh, oh okay, it locked onto him. I guess we're, we're not going to juke this guy. That's my championship, Jericho. Oh, damn it. That's not fair. Who the hell is that unnamed security guard? I want his name now. And I'm not talking about his indie name. I'm not talking about his future name for AEW Dark. I want his NXT name and his gimmick. Oh, my God. Wait, this is one of the best good scenes. Look at that. There's just a freaking set of weapons. Oh, my God. Not if the game can help it. He's now in pursuit. Wait, is he actually in pursuit? If I turn around, is he, like, still... I mean, oh, no, 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 oh my god, oh my god. What the hell was that? That was the closest thing we've ever had to a WWE horror game. What the hell? And uh, there we go. We've just teleported through the wall into uh, a multiverse, perhaps. You seen DiBiase and Rhodes around, Jericho? Uh, yeah, last time I saw them, they had some Taco Bell, and they did not look good, John. Either you come out here on your knees and put the title at my feet. <laughs> what, is this some kind of sick fetish you have? Get down here and put the title at my feet while you're on your knees. Are we seriously hiding it right there? I tried to hide it in the TV stand, guys. I did try. Chris Jericho shaked his head. <laughs> Is this Triple H's way of distracting me? Because it's kind of working. Word has it. Mr. McMahon wants you in his office right away. Oh, Mr. McMahon. I don't even like Mrs. McMahon. Oh, this is not a sight I ever wanted to see again. Vince McMahon becoming WWE champion. What the hell do you mean challenge match diva match? I'm, uh, this isn't my business. Although, honestly, if any divas match was going to happen in these roads to WrestleManias, it makes sense that it was this one. This, this whole feud has literally crossed every single road to WrestleMania we've done. These two have always been arguing with each other. So, you know what? I'm kind of fine with it. Jack, I'm just going to try and, uh, and I miss. After countless failed attempts, not to mention felonious activities, Chris Jericho is WWE champion. Now, why the hell do you have to say it like that? After many times of being a complete loser and a criminal, Jericho's champion. For the first time in this Chris Jericho road to WrestleMania, and it's time to execute some W rings. No way. Are you kidding me? My phone rings at this. Oh, God damn it. Looking good, ladies. Uh-huh. Thanks, Chris. Of course, neither of you can hold a candle to the beauty of my WWE Championship. Oh, that's it. Okay, you build them up and then you knock them down. I see you, Chris. If I can't beat him, there are other ways to keep my precious WWE Championship. Go out there and get myself DQ'd. All right, say less. <laughs> Instantly, I just got myself disqualified. I didn't even try to wrestle the match. <laughs> Not a single bit of that water even went in his mouth. You know, one thing that I do really miss about these wrestling games, and it's a very small thing that I wish they had, but I wish we could still have the microphone as a prop in matches and stuff. Like, even if there's no voice lines or anything, it'd just be great for cutscenes. Like, you know how many content creators would love just the, the ability to have that guy have a microphone in his hand just in the ring? Like, I don't think I'm asking too much there. <laughs> we sure hope Triple H will be okay. Oh, give me a break. He's the one who came out here in his gear. I'm dressed in this nice suit right here and he came out ready to fight he got what he deserved oh god just what i thought this road to wrestlemania couldn't get any more against me it's evan bourne evan bourne is gonna be mr money in the bank evan bourne is gonna be mr money in the bank shut up i'm giving triple h his chance at vengeance at wrestlemania and i hope he destroys you wait are you giving him his chance at vengeance or at wrestlemania that that's two pay-per-view stephanie my wwe universe brain is confused 
Oh my no. god, that was one of the most perfectly placed suplexes I've ever hit in this game. <laughs> what the hell is this? I, I, I just don't know if I could be a fan of Triple H after this. Um, what? Okay, you know what? I'm willing to accept that we had to face Ricky Steamboat there because we unlocked him as a playable character. So you know what? That's fine. I did not beat Undertaker tonight. I guess that when I didn't see any parades or bears on unicycles following you around after the match. Can he say that? <laughs> yeah, that's it. Triple H, suck on that bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh my God. <laughs> I didn't even know that was actually gonna work. You know what? Fine. That's the ending. Uh, I, I, I don't think this is gonna end well. Oh, oh, oh God. Oh, oh, good God. Oh. Of course, this is how it all ends, huh? No matter what, even though Chris Jericho literally won and put on a performance of a lifetime, there's a lesson to be learned here, kids. Death, taxes, and Triple H always wins in the end.